everyone and greetings from Tokyo. I'm in Japan right now and of course I've been eating all sorts of goodies and I thought I'd make you a little snack video here. Uh, I'm sure that I'm missing many essential Japanese snacks. You can uh, tell me what I should eat uh, in addition to these in the comment section. I'd really appreciate it. I can still, still have the time to buy them. So let me know, but uh, here I have just some mostly chips <laughs> because I visited this little chips factory, but I, I do have some essential sweets here as well. But uh, yeah, let me know. I'm going to be sampling all of these now and uh, let me know what uh, I should also eat in addition to these. Here's the view from my room. Let's do a little focus. I'm in Akihabara as any geek should be. Well, this is a really nice hotel and uh, right next to the Akihabara train station, so works for me quite well. Yeah, there's the Akihabara strip and uh, I've been doing some serious game shopping as well. But uh, now let's take, uh, take a bite to eat. I've earned it. I've, I've been to hiking to Mount Tsukuba today, so I've used plenty of ca calories, so I gotta gain those back soon. So I have more savory stuff here than sweet stuff, so let's alternate between them and start with the savory. I guess I'll crack open, open a pack of chips here first. Uh, like I said, I visited it, it wasn't really a, really a factory, it was just um, a, a Kalbi a store, but they, they did make their potato chips fresh there for people to eat and it, it was it was weird, you could get, you know, potato chip, uh, potato chip uh, desserts there, you know, soft ice cream or chocolate covered potato chips and they were salted. Uh, salted potato chips covered in ice cream and uh, it was it was pretty okay, but uh, it was also pretty weird. I couldn't really finish my <laughs> my portion there. I ate the chips first and then the ice cream, uh, <laughs> but uh, it was all all very good still. Uh, but uh, they also had several uh, chips on sale there, and uh, I just uh, picked up a bag where they had three different smaller bags. And uh, here we seem to have I don't know is this. Uh, jalapeno pepper and uh, a lemon. I really don't know what to expect, but let's take a bite. Biscuit on the outside. 
outside, wrapped around it with uh, chocolates on the end. Let's take a taste. And yeah, they're 
really, really fun to eat as well. Let's take another. Actually, 
let's do another savory snack here because I have more of them than I have the sweets. Let's do uh, a Pringles flavor that I've never heard of. Uh, apparently this is cucumber and dill flavor. Uh, yeah, the cucumber just sold <laughs> sold me this uh, this little package. I was really curious to taste what they tasted like. I have opened this and uh, I have to tell you they're really not one of my favorites. Uh, uh, we have had dill chips in Finland before and uh, um, that's not really the problem. The problem is that these are really vinegary. Maybe if you if you like vinegar chips you might want to try these out even though these have uh, a lot of uh, very different flavor to those but uh, there's a lot of vinegar in these. Thank you. 
it's a bit unappetizing for me, at least. Fingers are all messy. I 
this. Maybe they're good for dipping.
this is a really good candy. It's fun to look at, fun to eat, fun to hold, fun to do ASMR videos with. And yeah, it's it's really good as well. I'll see you next time.